Hey, what up, fellas? Right now, almost all the beaches are closed and barricaded off to cars. Only way to get down to them is to make a long walk. So we're out here super early. We're going for some trout and maybe some redfish, but also, if we can get a ladyfish, we got the second rod back there. And we can throw some chunks of ladyfish. Check it out too, man. It's looking pretty good. This is my first time to the jetties or the beach after the hurricane, so. You never know what's gonna happen. All right, first up, we're going with the beautiful she dog. Chrome bottom, chartreuse top. Really loud lure. I wouldn't mind going with a Spook Junior right now since the surf is so low, but we don't have one, so this is what we got. Let's see what it can do. Far outside, all right. And there comes that sun. I see us falling comes over. Board. You can come over, bring your best friend. Only thing we gotta look out for is some stingrays, because there's a ton of stingrays in the surf this time of year. Pretty much all times of year. Come on, Red. Woo! We're going for reds. We're going for trout. Trout mostly. And third of all, like I said, if we get a nice ladyfish, that's some cut bait. That is some cut bait. Oh my gosh, we landed on top of some bait already. A little, nice little gut right here. Pretty clear water too. Ooh! A little bit warm. I like it. Look at this. I don't know. You guys can't see it, but we got little little minnows in the water. Everything's adding up, boys. Everything's adding up. Oh, there's a, there's a guy. Wow. This feels like a feels like a trout to me, boys. A decent one. On the top water. <laughs> I was looking at my lure, and this I think is a nice fish. Unless he fouled it. He might have fouled it. But it's still a nice one. <gasps> Dude, that's a nice trout. Let's go. No way, bro. No way. Speckled trout in the surf. We got him on, right on the edge of this first bar right here. I was casting out deeper. I saw some bait coming my way. So I decided to throw on the bar. Man, he's a fat guy. Dude, okay. This is mean we're going to catch more. First fish of the day. Wow, look how fat he is, boys. You joking me? Look at that fat guy. Are you kidding me? That's awesome. In the top water, in the surf, you can't beat it. Man, I forgot to bring my freaking grips. That's a nice one though, dude. Look at that. Look at fat. Look at his stomach, man. You little fatty. Cool, man. I wanna see us falling overboard. You can come over, bring your best friend. Let's head back to shore. The main thing about the Sheet Dog, it's one of the loudest top waters there is. That's why I'm thinking it's not exactly ideal for these conditions, because we got a, sh a, we got a lower surf, not too much waves, making a ton of noise. We got the skunk off real quick. Now let's see if we can get a few more on the top water. We're getting lucky too with these clouds. They're kind of blocking the sun, so it's it's like an extended sunrise. Can't beat that. Yeah, let's try let's try soft plastic. You know what? I never really use too many soft plastics in the surf. I always result to using a Miradine or top water. Just because I think it's more fun, but if you can catch more fish, we'll switch. Down south lure, I think it's watermelon chartreuse. There, oh my god, dude, that was a giant fish. What? I just can't get the hook in anything, bro. That must have been a red. Look at that. Well, I don't understand why well, we're not catching them. That was a big guy. There's a guy. Yeah, there's your problem. I do, whoa, it's a whiting. Maybe that's why. That's probably why we're not catching them, boys. It's freaking whiting. They have tiny, tiny little mouths. They can't really get the hook. There he is, dude. That's a nice fish. I saw... Oh, it's not a nice fish. What is this? Oh, we snagged it. It's a lady. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that wacky rigged ladyfish. Well, that is bait right there, boys. Let's put that... That guy on the... <laughs> you know, we'll get another one, fellas. Don't you worry. <laughs> oh 
big stingray. Oh, that's one of the big guys right there. That's one of the, oh my God, he's got a brother too. Think he'll eat a soft plastic? Don't come towards me, fella. You crazy? That was a big fella stingray, and he has like a bunch of little ones around him. What? There might be one right here too. Oh yeah. <gasps> this one. Is this one? That's where he was hanging out, I think. Yeah, you can see a disc shape right there. Another one, he's coming back. He's trying to come back to his spot. There's a fish. There's a nice fish. <laughs> this is a nice fish, whatever it is. I think it's hard to say what it is it's not running like a red but it has oh there he goes a little bit it might be might be a low slot red oh yeah nice red dude a little red little not a, not a big one not a big one but always nice to catch red in the surf i'm pretty sure we had a pretty big red on earlier but i'll take this guy Nice. Woo. Cool, man. Little, little red in the surf. Still got that blue tail for us. And we got this guy on the down south lure. Very, very pale little red. Makes sense out here in the surf. Man, happy to get it. I don't, it's just not a keeper though. That might, eh, nah, that's about, probably about 19. We'll let that guy go. There's a fish. Oh man, that's a lady. Let's go. Nope, 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 nope. Last jump, and we got him. Oh, he can still get off right there, but now we're good. Woo, let's go. Biggest lady fish I've seen all day. All right, let's go get back to our stuff. Make sure it's not stolen, and then maybe we'll check out some ladyfish. All right, we finally got something we wanted to catch. We got the beautiful ladyfish all ready to go for some cut bait. So we're gonna rig some of this up, cast it out, and we're gonna keep chucking lures right, right around this area. Still wouldn't mind catching a keeper or two, so we're gonna go with a little bit smaller chunks. Hopefully get some slot redfish. Going with a modest little chunk. I would use about twice the size if we were going for bull reds, but like I said, we can get some slots. That'd be super nice. Since, oh, what are these? There's a mullet all the way super shallow. Man, this water looks amazing right now. Whew, it's a beautiful day, man. Beautiful day. While we're waiting for that bait to get hit, let's talk about today's video sponsor. Raycon earbuds, right there in the ear. These guys are the everyday E25 earbuds by Raycon. And if you've never tried some wireless earbuds, you got to try them. Like I said, it's way better than having wires. You just pop them in and not worry about getting tangled up. These guys have a compact design. They got the base. And of course, they seamlessly pair with your device. The great thing about these E25 earbuds by Raycon is they start about half the price of other top audio brands. And you know what? They sound just as amazing. Not to mention six hours of playtime. And even celebrities like Snoop, J.R. Smith, and Mike Tyson are obsessed with Raycons. So you know we have been lifting weights and these guys are perfect to use when you're working out. So if you do want to check out these earbuds, go to buyraycon.com slash thresherfishing and get 15% off your order. Woo! Got something messing with it. Kind of looking like a small bite though. And I don't think he got the hook. Dang it. Something's on here. Oh, it's a small shark. Wow. I can see him all the way out there. He's just gliding on these tiny little waves. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got going on. Oh yeah, it's a little guy. Oh my gosh, really small shark. 
Wow, we're boat flipping a shark. <laughs> Not usually what you, what you want to do, but it's a little tiny guy like this. No problem. All right, let's get you unhooked, fella. Look at that. Per perfect hook set. That's why we use circle hooks right there. Easy out, too. Look at this. He has another hook in him, too. Wow, he didn't learn his lesson. And this person did not use a circle hook. But let's see if we can get it out. Check that out, we already removed our hook, but he's got another one. Looks like it's only been here for about a day though. And it came right out, nice. Well, good thing we caught this guy. He should even be happy we caught him. Tiny, tiny little shark right there, but we got some hooks out of him. So he should be even happier now. You're gonna be just fine, fella. Just, you know what? Stop going for baits that have hooks in them, you know? That's my advice to you. Woo! He's out of there. Well, for not having any beach report, you know, we caught, we caught a red, a couple trout in the surf, not bad. And you know what? A couple sharks on the ladies. What I want to do now is hit up a jetty real quick. Woo! All right, final spot of the day. We're cooking it up Gary's way. We're, we're about, just about to leave, and we get this crazy trout on the line. Right on the outside of those hooks, and we lost him. <laughs> That's probably a keeper, too. Huh. Let's try on. There's another one, dude, right in the same spot. Right on the edge of this rock. Man. Woo. I'm catching some waves. Golly. Relax. <laughs> Just waves out of nowhere. Oh, I wish we caught the other one. He was even bigger. Tell you what though, <laughs> that's probably a little keeper. Boom. Yeah, <laughs> 16 incher. Let's go. We're keeping one 16 incher. Usually, I wouldn't go for it just for a small fish, but all I want is just one fish for a fresh meal. And we're chilling. Check out that absolute beauty right there. Not setting any records today, but you know what? We got one fish for you know a nice little meal. Got this, got this little guy on the deer way. And man, he, it's just a freaking beautiful day. Unfortunately, it's getting up. It's probably to 100 degrees, man. It feels like 100 degrees, so we're gonna get out of here. Love you guys very much. We'll see you guys next time. Far outside, all right. Wanna see us falling overboard. You can come over, bring your best friend. Let's head back to shore. Whoa, whoa. Give me something to forget. Everything she wanna be, lying right under her bed.